guys, so in today's video, I am doing things that I've been obsessed with or I've liked lately. And it's just very random, like there's some foods, there's some clothing, there's some movies. So I'm just gonna start naming them off and these strings aren't even. Should I leave them just to annoy you? No, I need the views, I need the views. We fix it, we're gonna fix it, okay. So to start off, I'm gonna start with like food and stuff. I only have a couple. So I've really been obsessed with, obsessed with dark chocolate covered coffee beans. And I would, I was going to show you them, but then my mom took them to work and I couldn't eat the rest of them. And usually my mom only tells me to eat like three or four because like they're pure coffee. And I usually eat five, so <laughs> Red Bull life. They're really good. So recommend those if you like coffee. If you don't, probably don't recommend those. Moving on. I've really been on a kick with smoothies, like homemade smoothies, and I have like kind of a really good recipe that I'll show you guys. Okay guys, I'm interrupting this favorites video because I just went downstairs to go make the smoothie and I noticed that I didn't have all the ingredients, but I'm going to name what I use. So I usually take like a little yogurt cup and I do the, all of that into the blender and then I do half of a banana and then I do like 10 pieces of fresh pineapple and then I put in like one fourth of a lemon and I squeeze that and then I put a little bit of milk in it and then blend that up and that's literally all I do. So it's super good and I hope that you guys try out and enjoy it and let me know if you liked it. Anyway, moving on to like animals and stuff I've kind of been obsessed with lately. So I've really been obsessed with my dolphin. Yes, I own a freaking dolphin. <laughs> Bottlenose dolphin, saving lives. Anyway, I've really been obsessed with my dolphin lately. Um, he's pretty cute, his name is Blue. Um, I'll insert a picture of him. I don't think that's actually a picture of him. I just kind of got that off the internet. So moving on, another animal I've been obsessed with lately is my cat. So this is Boy Cat and he, he really likes me. I'm his favorite probably. Um, but we have like a really strong bond and I'll answer some pictures of him because he kind of just ran away, but it's been pretty cute lately. Anyway, moving on. Okay, accessories and like clothing. I've really been obsessed with boy cat. So the next thing I've been obsessed with is hoodies. So I wasn't really like a hoodie person until like this past Christmas. I literally got so many hoodies and they're so comfy. Like I'm not even kidding. I like actually love hoodies now. Like I used to not really like them and not really wear them, but now like there's just something about them that are so comfy and cozy and like I can dress them up, I can dress them down. I'm wearing one right now actually. We love hoodies. Anyways, my champion shorts. So you guys already know these, like the black champion shorts that I literally wear all the time. If you've watched, my mom literally like brought up how many times I've been wearing them in all my videos and she's like, people are gonna think that like you don't have anything else to wear. Another accessory I've been really obsessed with is scrunchies. Um, I really like to like, accessorize them too, like not just wear them in my hair, but like some, sometimes like I wear them on my wrist like this. Um, I think they're really cute, but like I like to style them like this because like I like to show how many I have. And I usually wear them like this to school and stuff. And a lot of people think that I have too many, but this is like how I like to accessorize them. Very close, very cute, you know, very fun. Um, they're very just like casual, like there's, I don't know, I think it just like adds a pop of color to my wrist. Very fun and very like cool. Another one of my obsessions that's kind of been like jewelry and stuff related. I've really been liking earrings and rings lately. As you can tell, I'm like ring and I'm also like and I'm also wearing earrings. Um, but yeah, I really like wearing, like, I've been into, like, hoops and stuff. I know that's, like, a trend, but, like, I think that they just dress up an outfit a lot. And you can also, like, make them super casual. Like, right now, I'm literally just wearing this with a hoodie. And I think it's very cute and, like, kind of, like, gives this spin. Spin, spin, spin. So, talking about clothing and stuff still, I've really been obsessed with these long coats. And I got this one from Columbia. Well, I got it from Santa. But... It is the brand Columbia, and it's really warm, and I like how long it is. It's a really good length. So, okay, to like actual things that I like, I've really been obsessed with my tripod. Let me just show you. So, my tripod is pretty cool. 
Um, it's pretty big. I like to just casually like hold this around while I'm vlogging. Um, doesn't really draw any attention to me. I like it. Okay, moving on. The next thing I've really been obsessed with is this stress relief lotion. It literally smells so good. I think they got, I think I got this from, well, I didn't get this. I got it from like a Secret Santa type gift exchange thing, but I'm guessing Bath and Body Works. It smells so good though. Oh my gosh, I totally forgot I loved this. But for Christmas, I got these fuzzy ankle socks and it is literally the best invention ever because you don't have to wear like the above ankle fuzzy socks. They're like ankle it, they're like anklets, but they're fuzzy socks. So like your feet can stay really fuzzy and warm, but you don't have to like show off that you're actually wearing fuzzy socks. Honestly, the best invention in the whole wide world. I'm not even joking. Like your feet stay warm, they stay all nice and cozy. And like you, people don't won't even know that like you're wearing fuzzy socks. Is that not the best invention? I've really been liking my beanbag lately. It's pretty comfy, pretty cool. You, know, you can read in this and it's very soft. I didn't actually know how much I needed a beanbag in my life until I got one. The next super random thing that I've been obsessed with lately are my makeup brushes. So I just bought these up from Amazon and I'm gonna be honest, I don't really know how to use them, but I thought they were cute, so I bought these. The next thing that I have been really liking is this perfume. I think that my mom got this from Urban Outfitters, but I'm not for sure. If I can find it, I will leave a link down below to it, but it smells so good. And it's not like super overwhelming, but it's a very like fancy kind of smell. I don't know how to like describe it, but it's really good and I highly recommend it. And it stays on like all day. Like I can keep smelling it like throughout the whole day. <laughs> So that's really cool. The next thing I've been obsessed with is these juice cleanser, like sugar cube scrubs. I got these from Francesca's and I will leave a link to these down below as well if I can find the link. You're getting like a shower, you take one of these cubes and then you like rub it all over your body and it makes it really soft and it smells really good. Oh yeah, it kind of smells like cucumber. So this next thing just came in the mail, so I can already tell I'm going to be obsessed with it. Well, not really obsessed, just like it was kind of a necessity, but it is this jewelry holder and it's a gold and white and it's like a cactus and it's perfect for my rings. Demonstration. Look at that. Look at it. Literally perfect. It's almost like it was made for this. The next I'm going to talk about shows on Netflix and movies I've been really obsessed with. Hold on. So I've really been obsessed with um, Bird Box. It was really well done and it was really cool to watch. I have a lot of questions still for it, but it was a really good movie and I thought that it was pretty cool. It was very interesting and I hope there's Bird Box too because there's a lot of questions that weren't answered during it and I'm kind of mad, but it's fine. Anyway, I know this is like a really popular thing right now, but it's kind of just been one of my obsessions. Moving on. Another one of the things that I have really been obsessed with on Netflix is The Haunting of Hill House. And you guys would know that if you watch my Q&A, also link that down below because you need to go watch it. Um, and like, I'm literally gonna move to Croatia. But yeah, The Haunting of Hill House is like, if you're debating about watching it, literally, I'm not even kidding, go watch it. Like, it was so well done. It was like scary, but like intriguing. I don't even know how to explain it. I think I like kind of just repeated what I said in my Q&A, but you guys can go watch that if you are wanting to know more about me. Um, but that was a really good show that I highly recommend to anyone that likes thrillers. That has been one of my obsessions and favorites. That is all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching. I will try and leave all of the links that I can down below to anything that if you guys are interested in. And make sure that you guys like this video and subscribe if you're not already. Share this video. So thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys later.